Hey guys, my name is Evert and in this video I will show you how to make this pop-up and make sure how it will follow you in the, in the, in the shot. Um, yesterday I was searching for it myself, how to, how to make such a pop-up using DaVinci Premiere. I couldn't find it, but eventually I find out, found out how to do it. So this is a quick video to show you how I did it. All right, so here we are in uh, DaVinci Resolve. This is the clip uh, I already made. I'll show you uh, once more. Hey guys, my name is Evert, and in this video I will show you how to make this pop-up. So this is the effect we want to achieve. Um, and I'll show you um, in a new timeline so we can start from the beginning. So first of all, I'm going to drag in the clip, I'm going to play it, um, and I'm going to drag in already the, the pop-up. It's just a PNG with my name, like that. It's a bit big, but that doesn't really matter. Um, and I want to position it uh, at, at the moment you hear my name. Hey guys, my name is Ava. So about there, then I want it to be revealed then the opacity should be 100 um, so with the beginning it should be zero and then about three frames later it can be 100 and i want it about this long so about here it should be 100 again and here it can be uh, 100 and at the end it should be zero so it's going to be like this. And in this video, I will show you how to make this pop-up and make sure All right. I will follow so you. So that looks the, about the, right the regarding okay. the length of the pop-up. I'll place it a bit to the right, like that, a bit up, and a bit smaller, like that. And then I'm going to cut the video into parts, um, starting here. Uh, and so here and why I do that I will show you later but the important thing now is I want to combine these two clips into one I'm gonna press uh, in a fusion uh, clip so right mouse button fusion clip and then I can go to the fusion tab um, and then uh, that's not what I want. Why is that? Did I make a fusion clip? I think so, right? Oh, there we are. I think it still had the old um, clip. So then what we want to do is here on the uh, right side we see the end result. I think media one is this file and media 2 is just a PNG so I want to go press uh, media in the first file press control spacebar and type in track there you will find the tracker tool click it or add it um, then um, we will see this box and we will place the box over my eye something like that make sure we start at the beginning of course um, once again put it on my eye right about there oh that's not correct about there and I also want this box to be smaller. This could be a bit wider. But I want to avoid having the other eye of mine in the other box. So it won't see that. Uh, it won't track the other eye all of a sudden. So now I'm going to click on the track forward. And then the tracking process will start. And this could be quite heavy on your computer. So that's also why I cut the two clips shorter. So it doesn't have to to track the whole clip this could take a moment a 
All right, that looked good. It, it didn't go off path. If it does go off path, just do it again. Press Ctrl Z. Try to play with the box and make sure uh, it aligns with what you want. Um, so then we will remove uh, this one and go to the tracker. Make sure in the second tab its operation is set to match move and uh, we will connect the PNG with um, what's this let's see tracker foreground yes that's what we want connect it to the tra tracker foreground and then we'll see it's already connected um, so that's how I did it we'll go back to the normal play bar Guys, my name is and Avert and in this video I will show you how to make this pop-up and make sure how it will follow. So that's how I did it. Um, if I go to my own timeline, the previous one, uh, we'll, I also uh, yeah. made the pop-up grow a bit bigger. And I added uh, a sound effect, I just did with my own voice. Avert and, and uh, that's it. I hope uh, I saved you some time there. Um, and once again, this is, might not be the best way, but this is the way I found out and uh, it works. Cool, thanks for watching. Cheers.